Good morning, everyone. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, just taking a little break before I head out to Mom and Dad's to help with some snow clearing. We've had uh, quite the snowfall and um, a great little story. This morning, uh, what's today? Today's Monday. So Saturday, Saturday, Carl Hutton, one of our, uh, our favorite guides, McCarthy's Party Tour Guides, came to visit and uh, we ended up hiking over the top of the hill. We did a little bit of ice skating and over the course of the day, Carl was regaling me with wonderful, wonderful stories about uh, some snow clearing work that he's doing for a friend of ours, has a couple of contracts downtown. And Carl, you have to remember, and anybody that's traveled Carl will certainly appreciate this. Anybody that knows Carl will appreciate it. Tom's a lot, Carl's a lot like Tom Sawyer, <laughs> okay? And he can talk you into painting, whitewashing the fence because he makes it sound so much fun. And uh, I agreed last evening to give them a hand and uh, do some snow clearing downtown. And we ended up, look, when I first got down there, guys, <laughs> I wasn't into it very long and I was, holy suffer, man, this is hard work. And then I'm kind of shaking my head and I'm thinking to myself, what have you gotten yourself into? Like, seriously, dude, look at you. Why are you down here shuffling snow in downtown St. John's? And then I started thinking about it, guys, man, just, what do you, like, just go home out of it. Now, of course, you know me, right? I can't quit a job, not for work. Right? There's all sorts of different reasons that I could, but not when it comes to work. So I put my head down, and then, of course, when your head is down, you get to thinking. Right? Lots of time to think when you're only pushing a shovel. And I, get, I, I started to think about Tom Sawyer and Huck Finn, and, and I started thinking about the opportunity that Carl presented, the same as Tom Sawyer would have. Because without the Tom Sawyers, without the Carl Huttons, we sometimes let life pass us by. Uh, last night, listen, if, if you, you know, if you never took that trip down the river, if you never went on the adventure with Tom Sawyer, well, you wouldn't have met Aunt Polly, right? You wouldn't have met the Duke. You wouldn't have an opportunity to run the river with Jim. And last night, guys, and this is a big shout out to all the kids that we worked with last night. And I know you're not kids, but hey, we're all young at heart when it comes to shuffling. Gary and Jeff and Milhouse. <laughs> There's actually a kid there. His name is Johnny. But he introduces himself. He says, you know, so everyone calls me Milhouse. I don't really... I said, you, you can probably guess why. And, and guys, he does. He looks just like Milhouse. A uh, lot of fun. A lot of great short, shared stories last night. Um, I made a couple of notes just to make this easier because I'm doing these in, as you can tell, one uh, take. Uh, what else do you benefit from a Tom Sawyer? Look, Tom Sawyer got the fence, po the, the, uh, fence painted. And last night while I was working about and I was sizing things up and I said, man, Andrew, you know, use this to your advantage. And we made some fun videos last night because it was a miserable night and we spent the entire evening um, shuffling in a snowstorm wearing our climb outfit. And of course, any opportunity we have to give sh uh, climb a shout, especially when their equipment is working as well as it was. And, and it did work out really well for us last night. We had one suggestion for climb that's included in one of the videos that you'll you'll see after this so um take advantage of opportunities guys live your life as best you can i know we're in lockdown look go shoveling right seriously go shoveling great exercise right great bit of company everybody was social distancing we were working within the confines of what we're dealing with Right, and we all know what we're dealing with. It's uh, it, it, and it can be maddening, but there are ways, there are opportunities for you to to make the most of the situation. And you, like I said, em embrace each and every one of them. Find yourself a Tom Sawyer. Thanks so much, Carol, Drome, everybody. What a great opportunity. Thanks, guys.